Well, as you said during the warm-up, both players like this surface, and you can see why they can both hit through it. Pachikova was the one up 6-3-3 love. He's lost that match to uh, Coco. Oh. This has started as we hope it continues. It's a great forehand as it is, but it, you know, it can it can be a forehand that can withstand speed and spin. And I think that's what Coco is going to be building up to. She wants to create a forehand that she can win slams on every surface. That's the end, end goal, so. Yeah, I but I think you. if she, you know, it, 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 yeah, if, if it's not as extreme. It's if it's right now, but yeah, subtle changes, why not? Turn around in this game. And just wonder how big those misses will be. I mean, oh well, just doing enough. You have to hit very close to the line to get the winner, Pascal. Now it's Goff who has a tail up. Yeah, you could feel that, especially with the altitude here. Well, it's just a great point all round. And these are confidence-boosting points that Coco Goff is winning. Oh, Goff here, they're everywhere once again. But this time, the drop shot pays off. That's a ripper. Oh, she missed it. Well, what a way to end an extraordinary, brilliant, and dramatic set. But it's a set that goes Coco Goff's way. Brutal, but fantastic as the American takes it on the tiebreak in bang on an hour. Sabalenka on the second serve. Let's see if Coco can attack that. Oh, that's such a good point in the end from Sabalenka. It was a, a decent enough second serve. And then how about... Yes. The one last year and ended up losing it by uh, virtue of Shantek winning the tournament. So... But go um, again. Left, right, forwards, back. There's no place on this court she isn't. And she's dominating right now. As the world... Coco Goff is on the brink of knocking the world number one out. Serving for the match. Well, we know it won't be easy. A phenomenal performance from Coco Goff as the world number three makes the final here in Riyadh. Terrific sportsmanship as ever from Marina Sabalenka. An astounding player and a quality person too, but tonight is Goff's night. The movement was off the charts. Right, left, forwards, backwards. She was here, there, everywhere. And everything else working fantastically well too.